Hey everybody, it's Todd Ale again. Thought I'd give you a little tip on getting to the frog because I've been seeing a lot of students starting from here. So it's on my mind right now. I would like you guys to practice, maybe scales or just whole bows, uh, and get to this point on your epo. So you have this goal. You're aiming for that spot. You're really at the frog there. I mean, it's it's pretty drastic, but I want it to be comfortable for you. So I'm gonna give you a couple ideas. I want you to practice this in front of a mirror so that your bow doesn't go crooked. And I want you to just keep it in alignment with the bridge, but go way over the instrument and then take the button on your adjusting screw and touch the wood just touch that corner about. So you go over and touch. Do it a few times. Make sure your bow stays parallel to the bridge. Once you're doing that, you might take a look at your wrist. Does it rotate a little bit? Do you see some motion there? That's natural if I'm leading from the hand, okay? If I don't, it's gonna go crooked. So that you want, and then you have to undo it again when you come down. So leap from the elbow on the down bow, just let it fall and it pulls everything in an alignment. So the hand pulls on the up, the elbow pulls on the down, and you try and keep your bow parallel to the bridge. Now we're gonna do this exercise setting your bow on the G string. And what I want you to do is come from beyond, I mean above, over the G, and then come back. So it's an oval shape like an American football. Go up, make the oval, and set it down between first and second finger. Boom, you touch it, okay? Get used to that. Make sure that your shoulder didn't go up, your elbow doesn't go up. You're just nice and relaxed. This is all about getting comfortable using your full bow without tension. Then practice your bows, again, looking in front of a mirror, and I think maybe a good idea is to turn on a metronome. Okay, so that you, you might have four clicks per bow stroke. So it's one, two, three, four, turn, two, three, four. At that point, you gotta be right there again and turn, two, three, right? So you're timing it. You're not just kind of guessing. Can you actually use the entire bow? Make sure you have some rosin down here too, okay? So lead from the hand, lead from the elbow on the down. Hand up, elbow down, shoulder relaxed, parallel to the bridge, okay? I will see you later, thanks.